Hi, I'm Lisa and I'm one of the volunteers for the Food Bank Lifeline Foundation and I'm also one of the board members. Before Covid, we had four uh, distribution outlets where our clients would collect their food from. Because of Covid and to keep our volunteers safe and to keep our clients safe, we had to close those distribution units and move everything to here at Ormi. How we're now operating is that food and donations come into Ormi. We check the expiry dates on those, we then sort them into the different food types. Once we've done that, then they are packed into boxes and in each box there would be a week's worth of um, provisions for a family. Once that's been done, then they're collected by bulk delivery drivers or they are collected by St John's Rescue Corps, Walter. They take them out to our clients. We are so lucky. The teams that we're working with are fantastic. The bolt drivers are, you, you wouldn't meet a friendlier bunch. They're so nice. And St John's have been amazing. With St John's we're able to get out even more boxes because they have bigger vehicles to use and that's enabled us to increase the number of families that we're delivering to, so it's been fantastic. My name is Jane Mitzi. I'm a member of the board of Food Bank Lifeline Foundation and I also work as a volunteer. It's lovely when we know that we are making a difference to people, um, people out there in Malta who are in desperate need. We're all facing really difficult times at the moment and we've seen many of our old clients who we'd helped in the past get back on their feet come back to us and seek help once again and sadly that number is increasing. In fact, some of our clients send us messages to thank us. I'll read you a few. Thank you for all the work you do. We need more people like you in the world. Thank you for all your hard work. Stay safe. Thanks for caring. Messages like these give us the encouragement to keep going. It's very rewarding to us to know that we are making a difference. Our motto is that no person should suffer the indignity of hunger. And for that reason, we're working with Malta Trust Foundation, Victory Kitchen, Millennium Chapel, Food Banks in Gozo, Diaconia Massa Scala and St Jean Antide and together we're helping to provide food for families across Malta and Gozo. From all of us at Food Bank Lifeline Foundation, stay safe, stay home, Malta together.